And welcome back to Limit Media. My name is Nicholas Cartier, and today I wanted to talk a little bit about the Always Be Closing limited time event that if you're watching this today, then is the last day, and if you're watching this in the future, then this was an event that had just happened and or happened in the past. Um, before we get started, I just want to let you know that that subscribe button right there is waiting for you to ping on it if you enjoy our content. And if you enjoy our videos, or this video in particular, then make sure to give me a like. Let me know that you like listening to me rambling. That being said, let's, uh, let's dive into it. So, this event is, uh, it's pretty self-explanatory, pretty much for the most part. The, it's a... It's a game of Apex Legends, but instead of there being different rings, there is just one ring, and it is consistently closing, and or it always be closing, and I don't know, I really enjoy this, uh, this concept of the game, I feel like it really speeds it along, you know, some games at Apex can get around to be just around like maybe 30 minutes long, I've noticed that these games are not that long. Like, not 30 minutes anywhere. Probably around, like, maybe, like, 20 minutes. But, I don't know. It gives you a sense of urgency while you're playing it. And that, uh... I don't know. It hits me in all the... Hits me in all the right spots. I, uh... I've been trying to compare it... I played a couple games of this, and, um... I've been trying to compare it to my... Number one favorite limited time event that Apex has had... And it was the Fight or Fright events, where you were the, uh, in the Revenant Shadow World, and you were just a shadow person. And that, I, I enjoyed it. I enjoyed the hell out of that event, and this event is also very, very much so enjoyable. It's just, uh, it's got a nice sense of urgency, it's got really good pacing, and I feel like it puts everything that Apex has been doing on display, like, the best that it can possibly, like, be put on display for the most part. And what I mean by that is that there's been a lot of controversy with Apex and its pacing, how it's played. There's been a lot of loot box drama, and there's just been a a lot of, a lot of bullcrap. And I feel like this game mode right now is a very good representation of what they have to offer and what they've got for us moving forward into Season 6, because if you're watching this day one when we upload it, Season 5 is over by the end of today. It's got a day left, and Season 6 is right around the corner, and from everything that they've shown us for Season 6, it looks really, really enjoyable. It looks like there's a lot of things that, uh, that I'm gonna like, you know? In this game mode, they have, um... Uh, paintball mod that it's it's fun it doesn't really do much but it's 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 a fun thing to draw with your gun you know seeing a lot of penises on the uh on the map because you know people but also if you go through like the reddits and everything every now and then you'll see someone like post like something cool you know they'll show like the apex logo or they'll show nessie the little loch ness monster thing that they have the little apex mascot I don't know if it's technically a mascot, I'd call it a mascot. But, yeah, no, it's, uh, it's neat. It's neat, to say the least. But, other than that, you know, this game mode is just, uh, it feels nice. A lot of the, uh, it feel it just feels nice. You know, a lot of, uh, a lot of the gripes that we have with Apex have been, like, you know, bad servers. And a lot of things that aren't technically on respawn's faults. But at the same time, when they release a Wraith skin where you can, you know, shoot her in the head and her head isn't part of the hitbox, it can cause some concern. But I feel like we're starting to get past that kind of, uh, thing. And I feel like Respawn is heading in a very, very good direction. I know the next season is supposed to be more, like, lore-derived, which is, uh, which is neat because, uh, Rampart looks like she's gonna be real cool. If you're watching this, and if I haven't dropped it yet, I have a lore video for Rampart coming out pretty soon. I want to drop it, like, probably the day that she's available to download. Pretty much day one, season six. Or maybe a little bit before season six, because they've given us a little bit more, like, lore and what she's about, what her, what her abilities do, and that's something I'm real excited about, to be, you know, real 
real fresh and be real like first onto the scene for this kind of thing. And it's hard hard to say that you're uh, the first person doing something when it's like it's YouTube and there's a million other people doing the same exact thing. But I don't know. I'm just uh, I'm really I'm real excited to dive into season six and what respawn has to offer us really. But, as for this game mode, I'd say, uh, 9 out of 10 definitely, definitely would, uh, want to play this game mode again and hope it comes back in some other sort of, uh, iteration. And I am also excited for Season 6 and just, uh, you know, what they, uh, what they got, what they got to offer us. That being said, I don't really think there's much more I have to say about the current state of Apex or just this game mode in general. I feel like I've gotten all my thoughts out in the open. So, I mean, yeah. Make it a great day or not, the choice is yours. And by that I mean the choice is yours to finish this video. I'm going to let it play out because this was a pretty decent match that I played for this event. And this, uh, this match was actually one of the main reasons that... I wanted to just sit down and, you know, just kind of do a little, do a little unscripted thing and just, uh, I don't know, get my thoughts out there. I, uh, I really enjoy what Respawn's been doing with the game lately, and I'm excited to see what they're going to be doing moving forward. So, anyways, said it, said it once, I'll say it again. Make it a great day or not. The choice is yours, and stay hydrated, baby. champions.